Welcome to Admin Setup Account Types. In this section, you'll learn how to set up account types based on the business type. To begin, we go to Admin, select Account Types, and from this page, you see at the very beginning you have a business type. You can filter by business type. I've selected Bookkeeping and Tax Prep. If I focus in on just tax preparation, so you have account type 1040, 1041, 1065, etc., different due dates, extensions, inactive, and then the actual business type. Let me show you where you will see account types within inside the client file. I go to search, look for a client, go into the file, in the section account information, we have the field heading account type. In the drop down, 1040, 1041, 1065. So in this case, for this business type tax preparation, we're using the account type as like a return type. So return 1040, 1041, etc. And by selecting the account type, it'll default to the appropriate due date. In this case, the 1040 return was due April 17, 2012. So now let's go back to admin, account types. And this is where you'd set that up. So we have 1040 account type. I entered the due date of 417. That was the due date for 2012. If they file an extension, the due date was 1015. And the business type is tax preparation. To edit this, you just select the edit pencil. And you can then change the due date to whatever the due date would be for the, for the next year. To add to that, to add an account type, you just would come down here. In this case, say I want to put NA for not applicable. There is no due date, no extension, and I'm going to say the business type is tax preparation. I select tax preparation from the drop down, save, and that's how you create an account type for a specific business type. The NA right down there for tax preparation. I did the exact same thing, NA, for the business type bookkeeping. And that's all we have for admin account type setup. Thank you.